You haven't been around lately. I thought maybe you were an amnesia victim or something. Got a light? You don't look so hot. Do you know that? You're losing weight. This vacuum I'm living in. Mind giving me a reason? Not at all. You've had such a full life up to now, I thought a little peace and quiet would do you good. Give you time to think. Think about what? Would it be too corny to say your sins? Yes, it would. Well, I said it. You're cockeyed, Johnny, all cockeyed. I figured that's what the deal was. You're getting even with me for something. <laughs> We're great people for getting even, aren't we, Johnny? Are we? Aren't we? Didn't I get even with you for walking out on me by marrying Bellin? Great. That's just great. The man's dead And, and I'm glad. What do you think of that? He was insane, Johnny. I, I was afraid all the time. You acted like it. Johnny, there's never been anybody but you and me. All those things I did were, were just to make you jealous, Johnny. There's never been anybody but you and me. Not anybody? Not anybody. What about your husband? If you could forget him so easily, you could forget the others too, couldn't you? But there weren't any others, Johnny. When you I admit them. When you admit them and tell me who they were. You wouldn't think one woman could marry two insane men in one lifetime. Now, would you? 